Jimmy, this is the Samba from Lightcraft. Far and away, kind of one of the funnest, most disco fixtures we've ever had on the test bench. Yeah. Oh, look at it go. You it's might, great. yeah, you might remember disco. I wasn't there, but <laughs> oh, uh, come but on. I've definitely seen uh, movies like Fifty Four, and I'd be inclined to agree with you on that. Um, at its core, this is uh, a moving yoke. The yoke can pan, and it's got two tiltable heads on it. Each mm. head is a bar with four LED modules in it. As you can see, we've got very, very tight beams mm, out of them. Mm. Very cold white colour temperature, so it punches through tungsten really well. Yeah, yeah. Like we've we've dropped our studio lighting back maybe a little bit mm -hmm. on on our normal level, just to really you know sort of let the effect push through. But um, yeah, plenty of output and individual control on the tilt of those bars as well. So without actually even moving it, mm. you can already just just by choosing which pixels you turn on and off, get get some interesting looks. Once you start adding the movement into yeah. it then that gives you a whole different array of effects. Yeah, it's actually capable of doing a few little things within its limited repertoire, but it, it can actually produce quite a few different looks. Yeah, and you know, you know what I really love about this? We live in a time where like fixtures are, are requiring, you know, 30 or 190 channels to <laughs> control and stuff. Mm. Um, I'm doing this on, I think, 13 channels. Yeah. And I'm, I'm not even running this as a moving life. I've, I'm running this as just DMX values. Yeah, I think um, this is what it's all about. My lighting desk thinks it's a dimmer. Yeah. And, and you can get away with it because mm. it's so simple. And once you start adding some horizontal movement as mm -hmm. well, again, we start getting, yet again, a different dimension of looks. Yeah. Now, as I've said, I, I really just do see this as a, as a nightclub effect, but you've uh, you've got some other applications Look, you reckon. Yeah, I think it'd be great in a nightclub because um, uh, it it's, it's works in short throw mm. and it's cheap and stuff. Um, but I think you, know, you wouldn't need very many of these on a bigger stage on a more contemporary show mm. to generate some really cool looks. Mm. So, you know, like, yes, I think it, it definitely does hark back to that nightclub period mm. um, you know, and, and 70s disco. It's oh, like absolutely. That's, I, I turned it on and I just thought mm. disco, mm. Same, same deal. Mm. Um, but look, I think you could easily use this on contemporary shows and come up with some really cool looks. Okay, so it's cheap and very definitely cheerful. Absolutely cheerful. Mm -hmm.